God bless y'all in the mighty name of Jesus. Brother Alan Thomas here, Sermons Over Beats. We got another video from our meal prep coming from that new album, The Least Greatest. Now, this is the third video from the third track called Servants. And y'all can peep out the hat from Brother Carlos. Man, go ahead and, and support him. We're going to drop the, the website right below. And our scripture is coming from Matthew chapter 10, verse 24 and 25. It says, A disciple is not above his teacher, nor a servant above his master. It is enough for the disciple to be like his teacher and the servant like his master. Now, we're called to be like Christ in everything that we do. That prayer that you repeated at the altar that one time at church, that does not qualify you to stop living for Christ. That is just the beginning. That is not the end of all things. That is just the beginning to where you end that self and that flesh and you die to self. And you pick up your cross and you deny everything that you are and were and thought that you will be. And you begin to say, God, let your will be done. I am your servant. We hear that term in scripture, well done, good and faithful servant. Now, to get that line, to hear that line, is going to cost you everything. So I want to encourage you. Let's head over to the book of Acts, chapter 11, verse 26, where it says the disciples were first called Christians in Antioch. Right now, this is 11 chapters after Christ done ascended, and now they're being mocked by the people in the culture being called little Christ. But what does that really mean that we are called to be Christ like? So, I want to encourage you it is a life change. So, begin to pick up that cross and deny yourself, as Jesus said. I'm gonna go ahead and pray for you. So, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I lift up all who would hear this and watch this, Father God, at whatever point in their life that they're in, God, that they would become servants, God. Because you say, Father God, a servant is not greater than his master, Father God. I pray, God, that we would stay humble. We would keep humble hearts, God. But that also, Father God, we would realize that we are under authority, God. We are under your, Father God, supervision, God. You see everything that we do, Father God. I pray that, God, we would be more like you in everything that we do, Jesus. I pray those who struggle with being accountable and Father God, uh, being full of integrity, Father God, that you would help them, God. Those that struggle with hospitality, God, and being a giver, Father God, being cheerful with it, Father God, I pray you lift them up and speak life into them in the mighty name of Jesus. Encourage them and grow their faith, Father God. And we just pray blessing over everybody, Father God, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Well, I'd like to thank y'all for tuning in. I pray that the album and, and this video will bless y'all, and let's keep it moving. Yeah. Behold my servant, whom I have chosen, my beloved with whom I...